I'm waiting on you. Did you put on lipstick? A little bit, because I'm. it's the end of the day. I'm pretty scary looking. Okay, ready? <clears throat> okay, what I like to do is I like to start just like looking pleasant at the camera, and then I talk. All right. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for clicking video number three in my semi-unconventional Welcome to Young Living. This is my mother. Hello. <laughs> she is actually the one who introduced me to Young Living and kind of how that started is I think I started out with three oils and then she would basically bother me all the time after any sort of situation. I'd be like, mom. This is happening, mom, wah, wah, wah. She's like, use your lavender, use your peppermint, use your thieves. Um, and somehow that sparked into me now owning, I don't even know how many, probably couldn't even get you a complete count because they're scattered all over the place. Happens. Is that what your collection is like as well? <laughs> I have a full collection, yep. And I don't have them all. How many do you think you have? A bunch. How many? I don't know. 200. Probably, yeah. Okay. Well... <laughs> We are going to talk about one of our favorite um, young living concoctions that we credit my mother for creating. Um, we call it Rhonda's Robusto. <laughs> I don't know that I created it. She made it known to us. <laughs> <laughs> so, take it away, Mom. Okay. I didn't know I was going to do the whole thing, but... Well, I'm here to support you. <laughs> All right. Well, up first is uh, the Ningxia Nitros. I mean, not Ningxia Nitros, Ningxia Red, which comes in these little two ounce packets and the full bottles. Um, I like to buy it uh, on Essential Rewards. You get four uh, bottles of the Ningxia Red and 30 packet of uh, the little Ningxia packets. And these travel really well. They go in the freezer, uh, lunch boxes, pockets, backpacks, whatever you need on the go. These work great for that. And it tastes awesome. It does. It tastes really good. And it's good for you. A lot of people look at it and think it, it should taste like tomato juice, and it doesn't. It is very much a fruit juice uh, with Ningxia wolfberries in it. Um, read up on those. There's lots of great information out there. I am not going to go into a whole bunch of it, but these are um, good by themselves, but they're also good mixed together, which is how I like to have them. Um, I'll go through all of the the components to put it together. Um, the Ningxia Nitros. Um, this is basically energy in a tube. <clears throat> it is also a liquid form. You could just have these two together <clears throat> if you wanted. You could just have this by itself straight out of the tube. Uh, I kind of say that this tastes a little bit like chocolate covered cherries. It has chocolate oil in it, which is really, really good. It has chocolate in it? Yeah, chocolate oil. I need more of those. Yep. And um, then another a big favorite are the Zings. Um, these are kind of like, uh, I would say, comparable to what some people would say, a little bit of a, um, like a Red Bull, a five hour energy drink. <clears throat> um, it is a hydrating splash of energy. It, it, they're, they're fruity tasting, I guess is a good way to put it. They have uh, lime. Uh, the Ningxia wolfberries in it, black pepper, um, I'm... It's all set on front. <laughs> okay, but I mean, these won't give you the jitters or the shakes, mm -hmm. that kind of caffeine rush at all. I think, uh, I'm pretty sure it's the white tea that's in it that gives it a little bit of natural caffeine. I really like these mixed together. Um, the, the fizz is not real strong for those of you that don't like a strong carbonated drink. Um, so that's mainly the reason why that I enjoy it so much. Um, the other component to this, you could pick the one that you like, but uh, I like the um, orange or tangerine vitality to add to mine. Uh, you could use lime. Um, just so you know, um, we use this the Vitality line whenever we are going to be um, internally consuming. There is no difference between a regular bottle of orange oil and this one. They are the same. The labels just read differently. Uh, we do that to make the uh, FDA happy with us so that we can say that we can ingest this one. The other one we just use topically and we use them in diffusers. But very, very good. I like this one a lot. Um, so 
I usually start off with my Yeti cup. This particular one is one of my favorites. Oil up buttercup. That's one of my, uh, <clears throat> kind of one of my, my slogans that I like to use a lot. But I will fill this up with ice. And then over the top of the ice, I will drop, um, you can use as many as you like, but I usually use about six to seven drops because I really like the flavoring of this quite a bit. I don't count. I know, I, I don't either, shake. but yeah. <laughs> just, I just know that it's quite a few. Um, but the oils will cling to the ice. And uh, then I follow it with my nitro over the top of that. And then I pour in my zing over the top of that. And then I add one to two ounces of the Ningxia Red and just kind of slush that around a little bit and then it, it will fill it all the way to the mm -hmm. top. And it is a very good tasting fruity beverage that um, when it is gone, there's still a lot of things that are clinging to the ice and then you just fill it up with water and you kind of enjoy it, just a diluted version of that. So that's kind of my pick me up. Uh, I like to have it in the morning some people like to have it at 2.30, 3 o'clock in the afternoon instead of uh, coffees or sodas or um, five-hour energy drinks or something like that. So that's um, my take on it. I love it. I love these all individually as well. So um, I know for those of you out there that um, have times of the day that you need to really concentrate and focus on things, nitros are really good. Uh, nitros are really good by themselves as well. Um, this would be a great one to use before studying, before a test, um, before a big presentation. Um, just a good, good afternoon pick-me-up right here. Um, I used this quite a bit before uh, I had to get off of Cokes. And so I, to break that habit, I had one in the morning with my uh, Nink Charette. And then I would have one in the afternoon by itself. And I did that for five days and I had no headaches or no caffeine withdrawals in doing that. Nice. So that's my little claim to fame with uh, nitros. I know Morgan used these a lot when she was studying for exams to help give her that extra boost and that extra focus to stay on the job and get that taken care of. Yep. So that's our my little favorite combo there. Uh, I think it's kind of become a, for famous, a favorite of Morgan's too. Definitely. So, Anything else? Man, that's it. All right. Well, thanks for watching. We are blogging. Well, she's not. I am. You can check out the link down in the description below. Make sure you subscribe so you can check out video number four coming to you next week. Bye. Bye.